quick look at the alignment. Looks pretty good. Go ahead. And let's go ahead and move it. They're gonna start crashing here in a second. Put it slower. Okay. So that's as far as they go. Do we want to see it out here too? Might as well. Can't really see. Bring her home. Looks pretty good to me. Okay, so I guess that test seems okay. Okay, so you wanted to see it uh, 200 millimeters over. So let's do that in both directions, I suppose. Okay. We got that pretty even here. And let's see. You want 20 millimeter, 200 millimeters? It's kind of far. Let's see. I don't even know if we have that much travel. Oh, wrong one. Two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, I don't have two hundred. Maybe you said twenty. But uh, let's see what we got here. And it still looks pretty even. I'm not quite sure. How that's telling us much, unless we have a, a measurement to go off of here. Why don't I grab a marker? Just for the heck of it, why don't I mark this spot? Uh, why don't I bring it back uh, four of them oops wrong one again one two three four still looks pretty even and I mark it again It's uh, up to check it again. Looks pretty even. And then I mark it again. Back to oh. let's see where my marks are. So it kind of looks like this one's closer than it was last time. Let me see. I know this isn't 
super exact. But um, why don't we mark that? Let's bring it up one. So it looks like it was a little bit off that time from last time, but it's not easy to mark that. Let's try another one. I'm going to try this once more. That nah, looks pretty good. Well, let's go up a couple more. Nah, it looks pretty consistent. So... See, I don't know if that helps you. I think, I think if I don't have like a a good set of calipers to do that, I'm not sure how consistently that's going to come out. But I already have lines at the home here too, and yeah, it looks looks like it's traveling where it should now when I hit the back here it's probably going to throw it off a little bit that's the back see I'll do it once more Yeah, that threw it off pretty far, huh? I guess it's probably expected, though. I wonder if the front one will put it back in alignment. No, it's off. Out of alignment now, for sure. Let's home it. Now it's back to alignment, huh? Let's check that other mark. Now it's pretty well back to where it belongs now. But yeah, obviously when it hits that back, the alignment gets thrown off. Okay, before I tear down, I wanted to do one more little recording. Um, so I rigged up some screws on the, uh, the mounting brackets here so I could put this level up. Just to kind of see if it maintains the level on the Z-axis. Uh, obviously it's a little bit out of level right now. But uh, we'll just go off of that with the motion. So let's see what we got. it on the camera here. Now let me zoom out. I guess I don't get to zoom out any further than that. Alright, I'll just loosen the, the mount here. Okay. We're gonna hit the top soon. It's gonna grind, I think. Does it grind up? Maybe it doesn't grind up. It doesn't grind up, it goes up all the way. Okay, so it's up all the way. The bubble looks pretty close to where it was before. Now let's bring her back down.
Okay. I can't really go any further because I get too much junk. But to me, it looks like it maintains pretty relative leveling uh, in this type of motion. So maybe that helps a little bit, maybe it doesn't. Before I go any further, I had one, one more idea um, just to kind of rule out or positively shorten troubleshooting time. Uh, I went ahead and I reconnected the old set of linear modules to go ahead and perform a positioning tests really quick just to make sure that uh, they still uh, accept their limits. So let's give it a whirl. Okay, let's see what we got here. So that one's good. That one's good. And... Okay, so... We just confirmed the controller is okay because the other modules still have the appropriate uh, switches in them that are stopping the motion. But as you can tell by how uneven they are, these uh, are not in great shape, much like the other ones. I've actually gone through so many of these. I got boxes of them all over the place, and they just they they kept going bad, losing position, just many, many, many problems. So that's why I was very hopeful that the new modules would resolve the problems.